So let's begin by practicing your circular motion of ringing. You ring and come back up. Take your imaginary handbell in your hand and let's do that together. Everything you ring, you come forward and come back up. You ring. Make sure you have the mallet facing toward you, otherwise nothing is going to come out of it. Face it toward you and it will ring correctly. You may stop it with your hand or you may stop it with your shoulder, but you have to turn a little bit upside down when it's on your shoulder. While it's ringing, do not spill water out of the glass. Keep it upright. But when you stop it, you'll have to turn the bell. This is not a thumb plate. Hand goes on the bottom. So, what letter is this? F-A-C-E. This is a C. What do we call this? This is a rest. It's a symbol of silence. It's a silent beat. So, we said this is a C. I'm going to take the bell C, and if you look at the C, you can see the C, and you can see the staff, and it shows you that the third space is a C. So, let's, uh, let's play this. You're going to play C, 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 rest, rest, C, C, C. Let's do that. Ready? Go. C, C, C. C, C, C. And last lesson, I taught you about counting. We're going to say one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. What do you call these groups? between there, like from here to here. That's called a measure. This measure has four beats, and so does this measure, four beats. Let's count and play your imaginary bell. Ready, go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let's switch the rest. Let's put the rest on here. What beat is that? This is two. One, two. Let's move this rest here. What beat is that? That's beat four. One, two, three, four. Let's play it now. You count out loud. You have to count everything yourselves out loud. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let's have some more fun with this. We're going to have different letters. We're turning to a song. So let's have this here. Let's put this here, 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 and here. So together, I want you to tell me what letter each one is, and then I'll let you know if that answer is correct. What letter is this? If you spell face, F-A-C-E, you have a C. What letter is this? This is F. F-A-C-E spells face. What letter is this? This is C. F-A-C. What letter is this? F-A. That's an A. What letter is this? F-A. This is an A. What letter is this? This is an F. Let's say the letters together. And we're going to say the word rest when the rest comes up. Ready? Go. C, rest, F, C, A, A, F, rest. Let's do that again. Ready? Go. C, rest, F, C, A, A, F, rest. Now we're going to clap and count. You're going to clap on the quarter notes, and on the quarter rest, you're going to clap outward to have a silent beat. But you're going to say two on this. You're going to say four on that rest. Let's clap and count. Ready, go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let's switch the rest around. Let's put this here. 
on, on what beat is this rest? This is on three. One, two, three. Let's switch this rest around as well. Let's see, let's put this here. And on what beat is that rest? This is on two. One, two. So let's clap and count. Ready, go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. We're going to play now. What letter is this? This is F, F-A-C-E. We have the F right there. So, ready, count. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And remember I said, if you go to the same letter, F, F, you don't stop in between. But if you go to a rest or a different letter, you do the note, and then you stop when you hit the next rest or the next letter. Let's do that one more time with the F. Ready, count. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And let's say the letters. Ready, go. C, F, rest. C, A, rest. F, F. Let us do this letter. What letter is that? F, A, C. This is a C. We have a C right there. And here's a C and a C. Let's say the letters first. Ready, go. C, F, rest. C, A, rest. F, F. Let's do that one more time. Ready, go. C, F, rest. C, A, rest. F, F. Now let's say the counts. On what beat does this C fall? This is on beat one. On what beat is this C? This is four. One, two, three, four. And what do you call this group and what do you call that group? They're called measures. This is measure one, measure two. All right, let's play. We're going to count out loud. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four, one. Two, three, four. Let's do it one more time. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let's clap and count. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let's make some more switches. How about we put the rest here and we put the rest here. So on what beat do we rest in the first measure? This is beat one, one. On what beat do we rest here? This is beat three, three. One, two, three. Let's do this. We'll play the A. See the picture of the staff on there? And it shows this. We have an A and an A. Let's say the letters and the rests. Ready? Go. Rest, C, F, C, A, F, rest, A. Let's do that again. Ready? Go. Rest, C, F, C, A, F, rest, A. Let's count now. Ready, go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let's count again. Ready, go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And I'm going to introduce something fun and new for you right now. 
This is a half note. It lasts for two beats. So let's change this A to a half note. So you learned that each quarter note is a one beat clap, but each half note is a two beat clap. So this one, for this note, like say we had this note here, that would go one. But when we get to this half note, this will go one, two. It's a long clap. Let's do that, ready, go. One, two. Let's clap and count the whole thing. Ready, go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let's do that one more time. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let's do a review. How many beats is a quarter note? Quarter note's one beat. How many beats is a half note? Two beats. So, well, how do we play that? Hold it for two beats. We hit the note and we say one, two, and then you stop on three. Let's try that, ready, go. One, two, three. Then one more time, ready, go. One, two, three. So we're gonna play in the A, and we're gonna count through this. Ready, go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. See that? Let's do it one more time. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Isn't that neat? Let's clap and count again. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Now I'm gonna give you something fun I like to do. Let's go backwards. Isn't that gonna be neat? We're gonna go backwards on this. Ready, go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Obviously when we play the song, we'll always go forwards, left to right. But it's fun to go backwards. Let's do the backwards one again. That was neat. Ready, go. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Let's play it forward with A. Ready, go. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Let's go backwards. Ready, go. One, two, Three, four, one, two, three, four. This time, let's do, let's do C. We have a C and a C. Ready, go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And let's have fun. Let's go backwards. Ready, go. One, two. Three, four. One, two, three, four. Wasn't that neat? Going backwards. Let's do one more. What letter is that? F A C E. This is F. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And let's go backwards. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And remember, when you're doing a concert and playing this, it'll be forwards. Just like you read a book, forwards. But just for fun, we do it backwards. And let's do one more really neat thing. How about we put two notes together? If you have more than one pitch at the same time, it's called harmony. So here, harmony is so cool. They get played at the same time. 
Here's the A. Here is the C. What do they sound like together? You have the A, which is low, and you have the C, which is high. Ready? Listen. Hear the high one, and the low one, and together, they sound like this. Isn't that pretty sound? What if we had F and A? Here's the high one, the A. Here's the low one, the F. Let's put them together. Isn't that cool? You hear the A, F together. It's called harmony. Let's play that. I'll just give you three different bells, and when you get to the last one, you'll play it at the same time. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And you know what? Let's get all three together. When you have harmony that has three or more notes, they're called a chord. This type of chord is called a triad, like a triangle, because it has three notes. Ready, go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Lots of fun.